Hi, I'm Dr. Ali with Performance Play Sports Care, and today I'm going to go over infraspinatus tears. The infraspinatus is part of a rotator cuff group of muscles, and uh, it's usually the second muscle to be torn. The first one would be the supraspinatus. So typically with infraspinatus tears, you're going to find them in people who do a lot of overhead motions like volleyball players, baseball players. You can also get it from driving with your hands over the wheel like this and just putting a lot of exertional force on the back of the shoulder or with a lot of mouse motion when you're on the computer which can cause micro tears. So it's not necessarily like a full tear but it can be from overuse injuries. The purpose of this video is only for instructional purposes. If you feel like you have an infraspinatus tear, you should consult with your doctor first. I'm going to show you how you can feel around on your shoulder and find the infraspinatus and take this information back to your doctor and feel more confident. Let's go over how you're going to find the infraspinatus. You're going to go to the back of your shoulder blade, which is your scapula, and there's going to be a spine of the scapula that you're going to be looking for that runs across like this and the infraspinatus is going to be just below. It's a triangular muscle that goes out and attaches to the humeral head. So the main motion of the infraspinatus is external rotation, which is this motion. And then it's also going to be elevation and depression of the shoulder blade. To really understand the extent of your injury, you really should be getting imaging done. Once you figure out the severity of it, if it's a grade one tear or if it's just a strain of the muscle, your, your treatment options can include getting active release technique done, uh, you can get dry needling or any muscle activation technique. It's really important to address the muscles in the rotator cuff because you can develop uh, more of an adhesive capsulitis or an advanced shoulder condition. I hope you found this video helpful and if you want more information check out our other videos on our website and if you want to book with us go on to p2sportscare.com. Thanks. Bye. Don't forget to check out our ebook at the website below.